superstars we've ever seen, and he's planning on reminding everyone of that fact here tonight. There's no doubt that he's going to try and prove that in this one. The constant question still lingers. How long can Reigns remain at the head of the table? But he'll be facing off against the ever-electric Rick Boogs. The only thing bigger than his personality might be his muscles, Corey. Oh, man, that's like death by a thousand cuts. Ooh, what a nasty kick. That's disrespectful. And an answer for the big dog. and the heat there. Quick thinking from Boogs. Listen, Cole, you don't even need to ask what Roman needs to do in this one because Roman knows exactly what he needs to do. Assert his dominance. He's the head of the table. That's what he does. Ask and answer it, I guess. as they come. And he's done a lot to remake his career in the short time he's been in WWE. This is someone who can make it work. And I'm not just talking about the seasonal collection he's wearing. No doubt looking to turn some heads in more ways than one tonight. Then you have a battle-tested Viking warrior in Eric. Oh, look out! Hey, are you kidding me? He's getting a little batter now. It's nothing he hasn't been through before. No kicks out in time. He won't allow himself to be embarrassed. Just in reach of the ropes and gets it to force the break. The ropes become a competitor's best friend in desperate moments like that one. What's the best way to contend with the brutal striking power Eric possesses? You have to stay quick on your feet. Use hit and run tactics. If you mix it up with Eric, he'll drop you with those heavy fist swings. Powerless position to be in right now. Stomping every single part of his body. No respect being 
shown whatsoever with those stomps. Eric gets countered. Close line. What impact. Eric's able to dodge that with the Larian. Tagging this outside. This could be good. Spinning sidewalk slam with authority. Whoa. Able to get out of the way. Uh -oh. Going for the ride. Choke slam. Thrown out of ringside and back to the mat. And Eric's power being curbed with that attack. Massey turned some heads there for sure. Bang! Climbing up top, he's got big clothes! From the top! Oh, oh, drop. Oh, here he goes for the win. And he powers out. He thought he had it. And he's taking this to the outside now. Yikes. Oh, man. Oh, foot just stomping down. He eludes the contact. Close line. And Eric can't stop any offense coming his way. Stay quick on his feet thus far, not giving Eric the chance to strike back with heavy hits. Omase answers back. Oh, it gets put into the barricade. Look at this power! And Massey trying to worm his way into his opponent's head with that unusual presence of his. He's testing fate here in danger of a countout. He's been placed in the corner now. Countered it just in time. He's absorbing some tough hits now. At this stage of the match, they are really starting to feel the effects of this back and forth. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. He's got the answer for that one. Guys, we have been seeing the animosity building for weeks. And I know they've been keeping their distance from each other in the back for a while. Well, we're up close and personal now. is just vicious. No, I don't, I don't, I don't break his arm. Vicious. Ah, favor in his midsection. He could have a broken rib. Oh, man. Uh, really hard to celebrate a victory in this state. It was a battle that was incredibly intense. This should come as no surprise. Both athletes leaving worse for wear. Concerned about the health of the referee right now. Well, it's the face back here. Now there's nobody to stop these two from obliterating one another. There's no telling what could happen. Bell rings coming right off the heels of some underhanded tactics. Yeah, guys, there is no way that doesn't play a part in this one. Saxton, in this business, you gotta keep your head on the swivel, no matter who you are. That was just a quick reminder. Now trampling the opposition. This is just establishing dominance, followed by a stop. Hoping to end it early. And she kicks out. She's not going to go that quietly. Oh, what a kick. Ooh. Corey, what would you say Charlotte needs to do to come out on top tonight? If it ain't broke, don't fix it. Charlotte's accomplishments in WWE run a mile long, and that's because of everything she brings to the ring. Her athleticism, her nastiness, her aggression. She's always a dominant force because of those traits. And countouts are... Oh, a 
reminding her that she did not come here to play games. Vicious blow to the back of the neck. Oh, it didn't go as planned there. Backbreaker. And gets tossed back into the mat. their head. Oh, now we can see Charlotte. She's hurting a little. Flair retaliating. Big boot on the mark. A picture perfect leg snap from Charlotte. Oh my goodness. Oh, what a smash. That is just insulting. Looks like her opponent's not going to need a chiropractor. Into the knee drop. And into the count. Two count. Manages to escape before the three count. Able to squeeze that shoulder out. So close. Arms trapped. Just unloading knees to the body. A ferocious attack put on here by... Uh-oh. Dragon sleeper in corner. This could be it. I don't know what choice she has except to tap out here. She's going to have to tap. Oh, the world just how much fun she's got the left. <laughs> Mia gets fended off. Oh, my goodness. Really give up all these strikes. Oh, I think they've made it off. Shoulders down. This could be it. It. Her will to not give up fully on display. What she got in store for Flair? Courtesy of Mia, yeah. Will that clinch things for Mia? The cover! Amazing! It's not often Charlotte comes that close to defeat. You have to think the temperature of this match has just been turned up enough. Can't put this one away even after that big maneuver. Lift off. Oh, a dying Hurricane Rana. For the win. This match continues on. Great agility. Reversal. What a counter. Every maneuver being returned with counter fire. Showing any remorse. Well scouted by Charlotte. Eat the feet. Planted with a wicked DDT. Great counter. You have to sense that fatigue is starting to become a factor at this point. Make no illusions on it. This is coming down to a battle of a <laughs> what a shot. That's on you. Natural selection. Unbelievable. That's her opponent's move. You can see her on her face right now. She's thinking, are you kidding me? My own move? There's got to be some sense of desperation right now. She's used her best weapon, but the match still continues. Oh, what a shot. And now tying up the leg. Straight to the knee. Got the underhook. Nice standing backbreaker to take down. Oh my goodness, dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. Incoming! Is the figure four 
And Charlotte now bridging up. Figure eight from the Queen. Charlotte Flair can tap out. Here is your winner, Charlotte Flair! He writes his own ticket. He loses. He may well go back to the drawing board. No two ways about it. It's put up or shut up for this challenger tonight. And then there's Gunther, a proud competitor with a simple objective. He's out to restore honor and glory to the ring. He's trying to clean up the riffraff around here and return some dignity to this industry. Oh, is that what you call it? Because it seems to me like he just looks down on everyone else. No one is good enough in Gunther's eyes not to take him on or even stand shoulder to shoulder with him. You say proud, I think he's conceded. Makes him pay with a counter. Stop people dead in their tracks with a single thunderous blow. How do you deal with an opponent like him? You have to weaken him all while making yourself a hard target. So be selective with your attacks and try to land blows to the legs or midsection. That'll help cut the big man down to size.
this is the type of victory where you really have to weigh the costs against the benefits. The reward definitely seems greater than the risk right about now, but we'll see how they feel once they